In a previous video, we used this equation to calculate formal charge. I want to go to this part of the equation, and it says we only use half of the bond pair electrons when calculating a formal charge. So this part of the equation best describes what we're actually doing. The drawback is the process becomes very redundant, where if there's one bond, we would have two valence electrons, and we would divide that by two because we only use half, which would equal one valence electron. So what we could do is skip that part and just simply say one bond equals one valence electron. And we get an equation that looks like this. The formal charge equals the number of valence electrons in free atom minus the lone pair of electrons minus the number of bonds. So let's run it and calculate a formal charge. Hydrogen has one valence electron, it has no lone pair electrons, and it has one bond. So we come up with a formal charge of zero. Nitrogen has five valence electrons, it has no lone pair electrons, and it has four bonds. So we have a charge of positive positive 1, and we can put that next to the nitrogen, the circle around it. The nitrogen has a positive formal charge.